All right, so we are free to look around again. That is awesome. Let's go talk to our friends again. I think there might be new stuff to talk about, maybe. What is Everything going all right so far? Oh, hello. How did you become Viscount? I don't understand how you just become a Viscount. When the ruler of a marcher state dies and there's no heir, the nobles of the city pick a new ruler. Only none of Kirkwall's nobles actually want the throne. Most of them think it's cursed, actually. Understandable. They can't leave it empty, though, or some other state like Starkhaven or Ansberg will probably invade. I complained about the empty office when it interfered with my reconstruction efforts. They took that as volunteering. Aw. No fan club today? I'm surprised no one from the Council of Heralds wants your autograph. You just missed them. Duke Cyril keeps asking me for spoilers. Oh yeah, Harden Hightown is like super popular in Orlais. What's up with Bran? So, Bran used to be Viscount, and now he just... follows you around? Provisional Viscount. Pretty much. With a permanent appointee, finally, in the Viscount's office, I am free to return to my post as Seneschal. He means my true calling is arrogantly telling people they can't talk to the Viscount. He's good at it, too. Sure. Uh, that was a little... I'll be here if you need. Well, a little rude for poor Bran here. Let's see. Is there anything new? There were those paintings that we found, or one painting we found in the last episode, or... Well, before we had headed into the Illuvian. But, while we're here, we should talk to our friends. The rest of them. Dorian! Anything new? I can't believe it's been so long. Around two years. That's it? Two years? Sweet, merciful maker, it felt like ten. That could have been all the wine. Only thing back home I really missed. So, you're an ambassador now. How's What's that working out? What's ambassadorship about, exactly? I believe my father set it up, but... The Imperium certainly didn't object. They'd love for the Inquisition to fall apart. So they're happy if it seems they consider this council a waste of time. That makes no sense. No? If Dread to Vinter actually pushed for the Inquisition's end, everyone else would disagree on principle. True. So they send a nobody pariah and hope for the best. Makes perfect sense to me. I like your explanation. Thank you for that. So you've been gone for a long time. What did you do in Tavinta while you were away? I went home. Twice. Father was only there once. Mother was drunk both times. I also went to Carinus to see my good friend Mayveris. Then I settled some of Alexis's affairs. That wasn't fun. I bet. What are your thoughts on the Council? Any thoughts about the Exalted Council? A few. Divine Victoria needs a new tailor for one. Cassandra in a flowy dress just seems wrong. And that hat does her no favors. Should I for this whole tell her that? That you said that? She might kill I you. I warned you once that no one would thank you for saving the world. Sadly, I'm always right. So long as the Inquisition's around to remind them they're not really in charge, they'll never sleep comfortably. Whether they have the guts to take action, I suppose we'll see. Sure. Another Who's thing. next? Vivienne? I look forward to it. I think so. Darling, what can I do for you? Ooh, can we talk about the new Divine? Are you, like, super disappointed you didn't get elected? I wanted your opinion of how Divine Victoria is working out. Cassandra is handling her office as admirably as I expected. History will remember Victoria as a truly great divine. Wow, that's kinder than I would have thought. How's things in the Circle? How are things for the Circle of Magi? The Circle is recovering. So much was lost during the Rebellion. Lives, most of all. So many experienced teachers gone. But I have hope and determination, which is better. Maybe they should have a visit from the Grand the Inquisitor Hera at some point. Oh, another painting! Also, paintings aren't um, interactable. I'll have to uh, take a look at that off camera. Uh, Liliana, you are next, right? Inquisitor, is there something I can help with? 
How are your nugs? Tell me about your nugs. That's not innuendo, I promise. Oh yes, a litter was born just a month ago. We are weaning them right now. If you are hoping for one, I'm afraid they're already spoken for. Aww, can I call dibs? Ooh, how is the hero of Ferelden? Have you found her? How are things between you and the hero of Ferelden? We are well, thank you. Our duties have kept us apart for a long time. Perhaps it is time to put duty aside and be selfish. I have sacrificed so much already. Also, why are you standing like that? It seems kind of weird. Maybe you're like sitting on the uh, armrest there? Have you spoken to Cassandra? Have you met with Cassandra since her return? Oh yes, she's quite relieved to be out of the robes and back in the armor. I just hope she doesn't forget everything she's learned as divine. It took two years before she stopped hiding a sword under her vestments. <laughs> what's... what's the news? Have your agents any news I should hear about? They're probably... There's activity in the Tirishan. Strange elves, like those of the Temple of Mithal. Solus' agents? Solus, probably. Alright. Perhaps later, Leliana. I'll be right here if you need anything. I wonder if um, Cassandra's gonna be up here still? I doubt it, because there's no, like, indicator. But let's run up and check. And there might be any... Uh, paintings on the way. No paintings? No Lilian or uh, Cassandra? No dukes? What are you guarding? You seem very aggressive, sir. Put your hand off of that pommel. Or grip, or whatever. There's probably no painting up here, so next up is Colin. Was there something you needed? Is there anything to report? Is there anything I should know? We were permitted soldiers here, but our every move is watched. Some things never change. Back at the Winter Palace? What? Do you remember the first time we came to the Winter Palace? All too well. I've already answered a half dozen questions about my personal life. Also, I like that you have your foot on that basket. That's worth enduring the political small talk. How's the family? Is there Didn't I ask about that them? before? How is your family? Any well, updates? Sophia keeps me informed. As I understand, she's training my nephew to best me at chess. Are you sure that's... gonna be possible? I sense a threat to my commander's chess superiority. I'm sure the defeat will be distressing. I... he's four. You could at least pretend I'd throw the game. <laughs> no? I should go. You're probably gonna lose badly once he's five or six. Alright. Who is next? This is going to be Blackwell, I think. Need me for anything? How are the wardens? What is it like being a warden now? Things are in upheaval. There have been heated arguments about the future of the order. <sighs> I wouldn't be surprised if we tore ourselves apart. Okay. But I think Elan is going to pop back in at some point and like Reunite them, maybe in Dragon Age 4. Thoughts on the Council? What do you think's going to happen at the Exalted Council? Maker, I have no idea. Politics always makes my head spin. The Inquisition shouldn't have to give in whenever some prissy noble gets their knickers wedged somewhere. This is a bit of a reunion. It's nice to have everyone back in the same place again. <laughs> I have to admit I missed it. Even what Sarah? What does mean when we need a huge diplomatic talk or the world ending just to bring us together? I got the chance to have a few drinks with Sarah. Miss that girl. Aww. It's still a little awkward talking to Cassandra. But the commander appears to have forgiven me. Finally. Good. That's good. Until later. Take care. Next is Cole. Your hand hurts. A heartbeat, not yours, hammering the beat of a song in its final verse. I'm sorry. Uh-huh. She killed the girl to save herself. She thinks about the eyes going black. A weapon is an order, not a gift. Interesting. It was the same boy. His mother on the ship, his father in their homeland. He grew up lonely. Or didn't. It always had a soul. The question is the answer. 
This is cryptic. You even come back. The chest gives you another. That's how we know too much. Barefaced but free, frolicking, fighting, fierce. He wants to give wisdom, not orders. Her name is different now. Victoria. The old name slips away further each time. She's glad you're here. Me too. The Guardian spirit stayed, not bound, but biding, because he asked. He knows how to speak, so spirits listen. That's about Solus, isn't it? He did not want a body, but she asked him to come. He left a scar when he burned her off his face. Interesting. His friend had to die, because he thought they were people. A slow arrow breaks in the sad wolf's jaws. Hmm... Well, that's gotta be Fenrir as well. The Dread Wolf. the dreams to stop the old dreams from waking. The wolf chews its leg off to escape the trap. When this is done, I will slip back safely, a spirit. Someone is hurting. He needs me to remember who he is. The spirits have fled, flying, fluttering, fast to the farthest fade. They're afraid of the veil tearing again. Well, I think it is. Because Solus is um, tampering with it. Also, why do you have to take a step forward whenever, every time I talk to you? They made bodies Stop from pushing the me. earth, and the earth was afraid. It fought back, but they made it forget. Hello. 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 Stop pushing me. That was a lot of uh, cryptic, but possibly insightful um, sentences from Cole here. Is Iron Bull going to talk to me now? Please? Hey, boss. Yeah! How is our alliance? If you've lost touch with the Ben Hasrath, what of our alliance? Well, the last time I heard from them, we were great. You killed Corypheus, sealed the breach, and closed a ton of rifts. They couldn't ask for more. This whole operation has to be a mistake. Bring me with you, and we'll figure it out. I promise. Sure. I'll talk to you later. Anytime, boss. Now. There's one thing I've been wondering about, or worried about, I should say, is that in the base game, we always, um, from the start, we had Solus with us, and he kept talking about those elven um, artifacts that so-called strengthen the Fade, but who knows? Is it going to be like the opposite? Are they going to be used for... Weakening the fade or are they gonna use be used for something else else because they're they're like everywhere I think there's even one in this palace somewhere and if they're used as like weapons or something like uh, weakening the fade for Fade invasions future fade invasions. We're pretty screwed So I'm hoping that's not gonna be the case Sarah Hello, and shh I'm trying to figure out why everyone is acting so weird I mean, besides because Canary assassins and everything. You see it, right? There's something going with the elf servants. Makes sense after that ruin, right? Yup. When you start going on about elves, it's hard to tell if it's about them or you. Yes, yes, you're ever so clever, ass. Point is, the servants have no complaints. No asking for a Jenny. They serve this lot, but don't want them done for anything. So, the nobles are nice, and the servants are happy? Two things that have never been true. Mark that I said it. We're fighting Canari, but something else is on the up. Yup. I suppose you've a lot to say about that elven ruin. About the creators. They're not even demons. Just big magey knobs punching down. And yes, the shits who use them to make me feel broken can still eat it. But always waiting for that fight is way too much work. It's like doing half the hurt for them. Maybe we're old now, but I'm tired of it. We've new fights to look forward to. We always do, seems like. What are your thoughts on the Inquisition? It's been a couple of years. How's everything sitting with you? It's weird meeting back up and seeing everyone get their grey. First time I've been anywhere long enough to get fond of things. Cassandra is staying herself. So far. Hopefully. She needs someone to watch out for her. So I kind of do. All that blood and thunder just so everyone can live well an hour once around. Good lesson, I suppose, if there had to be one. Right, good we'll talk. talk later. Count on seeing you, yeah? 
Of course. Who's next? We got Josephine. Yay, Josephine. Let's head over there. Cassandra! Oh, totally could have missed you. Varric, of all people, become the Viscount of Kirkwall. <sighs> a mystery for the ages. That is a silly hat. I gotta agree with uh, Dorian about that. How have you been? So, you've been quite busy? Ugh. <laughs> that bad. Being divine is like trying to herd a field of cats into a lake for a much needed bath. Even so, I would be pleased with my progress were it not for all the attendants picking over me constantly. And the hat! Needless to say, I'm more than happy for this diversion. I mean, you are divine. Can't you, like, ab ab abolish the hat wearing? How are the Seekers? I hear you've been rebuilding the Seekers. Slowly, but yes. I managed to find a few of my former comrades who'd scattered to the winds. Some of them were unsuitable, and I did not ask them to return. Others felt as I did once they read the Lord Seeker's tome. We've since recruited a few candidates who are going through training now, with full disclosure. What comes after this, I cannot be certain. I am making it up as I go along. Don't we all? <laughs> Sounds familiar. I thought you'd appreciate that. So, about the Council... What do you think of the Exalted Council? They are frightened of your power, and there is no longer a hole in the sky to remind them that it was needed. I could remind them, no. They might be right. Do not say that near them unless you want to give them the scent of blood. Even so, I would wait and see where this leads. Karma heads may yet prevail. When has that ever been the case? I'm an optimist. Just ask Varric. Sure. I'll see you later. Farewell. Now, here's what I think is gonna happen. I think at the end of this uh, thing, the Inquisition is gonna be told to disband, and we are gonna pretty much oblige, but our core group is gonna like go after Solus or the Kunari, and that's gonna be the setup for the next game, which I'm super excited about. That's probably gonna take place in or around Tevinter. Um. What? Find the Harlequin? Well, okay. So I guess that was the one that was teleporting around and had to like go around her? Or she would um, disappear? Okay, weird. But I'll take it. Next up, my lady Josephine.